case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1993, the Supreme Court of Indiana heard the case of Miller Brewing Company v. Best Beers of Bloomington, Inc., which revolved around punitive damages in breach of contract cases. The legal rule states that punitive damages cannot be awarded unless there is proof of a separate wrongful action. Miller Brewing Company had an agreement with Best Beers to distribute their products in certain counties. After Miller terminated the agreement due to poor performance, Best Beers sued for wrongful termination. The court ruled in favor of Best Beers, awarding compensatory and punitive damages. However, Miller appealed the decision, seeking a new trial without punitive damages. The Supreme Court of Indiana clarified that the termination statute requires consideration of the other party's interests and does not allow for punitive damages in breach of contract cases unless a separate tort was committed. Ultimately, the court upheld the compensatory damages for best beers, but removed the punitive damages, as there was insufficient evidence of an independent tort. The admission of an irrelevant document, the Crowley letter, was deemed harmless error. This case serves as a reminder of the legal rule that punitive damages require proof of a separate wrongful action in breach of contract disputes. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.